Hello, I'm Rachel, live from Kalkine Studios, and you're watching the IPO Corner, a weekly show dedicated to IPO market performance with public offerings and listing companies under the spotlight. Before investing in any shares, investors need to understand the business prospects and operations in detail, such as future risks and returns. This can include changing the IPO price or issuance date as companies see fit. On that note, let's take a look at proposed IPO listings scheduled for the coming week. First up, we have junior mineral exploration and mining firm Terra Uranium. They're set out to play a role in a clean, carbon-free economy. The company is exploring and developing a portfolio of high-quality market-sustaining uranium assets with a primary focus on Canada's premier Athabasca Basin. This area contains the world's largest and highest grade uranium deposits. The company has undertaken a $7.5 million public offering at 20 cents issue price. The company plans to list on the Australian Securities Exchange on the 8th of September at 11 a.m. Australian Eastern Standard Time. Terry Uranium is led by a management team based in Canada. Next on the list is Octava Minerals. This mineral explorer is engaged in lithium and gold discoveries and has assembled rights to acquire interest in a portfolio of mineral exploration properties within Western Australia. The main focus is on lithium, gold, platinum group metals and nickel sulphide prospects. Prices for green energy minerals such as lithium and platinum group metals has been trending positively recently, with much of this being attributed to the increasing demand for electric vehicle batteries and power storage uses. Octava Minerals has undertaken a $6 million public offering at a $0.20 cents issue price. It plans to list on the ASX on the 14th of September. The company is conducting exploration at three main project areas, East Pilbara for lithium and gold, East Kimberley for nickel and platinum group metals, and Yalla Long for gold and nickel sulfides. Well, it's time to wrap up the IPO Corner Show, but remember, before investing in IPOs, investors must check the company's credibility and track record. Risk appetite can vary by investors. They need to consider factors such as an analyst view, brokerage ratings, industry outlook, financial performance, and a peers review before making investment decisions. It's also important to note that companies can change the IPO price or issuance date as they see fit. Well, that's all for now for the IPO Corner Show. Stay tuned to Calkine TV. We've got more shows for you with live updates across the economy, markets and sectors. This is Rachel signing off for now.